Despite life's puzzle in disarray, we rely on God to make us whole. Top of the morning to you. So there's not a whole lot of things in this world that we can be confident of or have confidence in. Uh, it seems like the, the puzzle of the world is just kind of in disarray right now, the puzzle of life. But we can be confident in this biblical promise, Philippians 1, 6. Be confident in this very thing, that he who began a good work in you will complete it until the day of Jesus Christ. God is not like us, who begins many projects, yet completes only a few. He's not a halfway kind of God. He's full, complete, whole, perfect, not lacking in anything. Uh, just look at what he's full of in his word. Psalm 116, 5. Our God is full of compassion. Psalm 29, 4, the voice of the Lord is full of majesty. Psalm 48, 10, his right hand is full of righteousness. John 1, 14, Jesus is full of grace and truth. Psalm 16, 11, in his presence is fullness of joy. God's creation has the same attribute of fullness. Psalm 119, 64, the earth, O Lord, is full of your majesty, or full of your mercy. Isaiah 6, 3, the whole earth is full of God's glory. Psalm 11, 9, the earth shall be full of the knowledge of God. Psalm 24, 1, the earth is the Lord's in all its fullness. Of course, Jesus was fully God and fully man. Titus 2, 13, our great God and Savior, Jesus Christ. Isaiah 9, 6, for unto us a child is born, his name shall be called Mighty God. But what about us? In Colossians 2, 10, we are complete in Christ. 2 Timothy 3:17 that the man of God may be complete, thoroughly equipped for every good work. We are assured of this in James 1.4, when we let patience have its perf perfect work, we will be made perfect, complete, lacking nothing. So when life seems out of sorts and nothing makes sense, rest assured God is still on the throne. And we are guaranteed in Romans 8.28, all things work together for good to those who love God, to those who are called according to his purpose. That's us. That's you. That's me. So don't worry about making sense of the things in this world. God's got it, and he has a plan. Isaiah 55, 9, my ways are higher than your ways, and my thoughts higher than your thoughts. So relax, trust, and lean on him. You won't be sorry. Have a great day.